everyone, I'm Jacqueline. And I'm Luke Frank. And we are here with Elian making some more chronic cocktails. All right, so today we're gonna make a champagne cocktail, uh, which is a pretty simple cocktail, but it doesn't taste simple. It's really, really delicious. And this wouldn't be chronic cocktails without the chronics. So Hey, where's it at? <laughs> it is in the bitters. So okay, okay. a traditional champagne cocktail is um, Angostura bitters on a sugar cube, put it in, pour the sparkling wine over, voila. Um, so we're gonna do something very similar, um, but we made cannabis bitters. And making bitters is not a simple Yeah, I'm, I'm kinda curious, what, what is a bitter? I'm not too Yeah, sure. so bitters actually, um, you see them in little bottles. Generally what you do is you just put a dash or two okay. in your cocktail. Um, it gives it some nice aromatic compounds, also, a bitter flavor. Mm, um, kind of like, kind of like terpenes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Exactly. Um, I mentioned orris root, which kind of tastes like violet. Um, we've got dandelion leaf in there, which is very bitter, but also has like kind of a nice chicory coffee flavor to it. Wow. And so, getting fancy today. <laughs> right. I know. You basically just go ahead and put all of your um, bittering agents. But you also have flavoring agents, so you want to balance out the bitters. You don't want it totally bitter. Um, so you have dried orange peel, yeah, dried cherries. We got a lot cherries. going on in here. Yeah. Um, so we've got our can of bitters here. So we can go ahead and start making our kind of cocktail. Let's so, do it. so what you do is you go ahead and we've got our sugar cubes here. So go ahead and just sprinkle some um, can kind of bitters. <laughs> so just sprinkle. Don't right be on shy. The cube. Yeah. Don't be shy. Just cool. douse that sucker. All right. Good. So then go ahead and just pop those in there. Nice, nice little clink there. I can kind of like, smell it already, the yeah, aroma. It's, it's super aromatic. Yeah, so let's get the sparkling wine. So um, generally, this is called a champagne cocktail, and you usually use champagne, but we are a Sonoma County-based company, and I like to say what grows together goes together. So we have a Sonoma County sparkling wine right here. Nice. And, um, you know, generally want to choose a wine that's on the drier side. So look for something brute. And I'm gonna open it. It's a little slippery. I'm a so. smoker. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> well, so sparkling wine, um, you can get a lot of different types of sparkling wine. This is made in a super similar way to uh, champagne. Okay. Whoop, there Ooh, we go. Little, little fizz. And pour slowly because they will fizz. Definitely gave more than just a dash on the sugar cube. The bubbles are kind of like pushing the yep. aroma. That's cool. And so, um, you know, I didn't mention um, the most important ingredient in our cannabis, which is cannabis. Oh yeah, I was wondering, where is the <laughs> cannabis in it? What kind so of the cannabis is in here. You go ahead and you decarb it like you would for any, um, you know, any edibles or tinctures, and then you just let it sit in there with the you other ingredients. Kind of see it flowing around right yep, there. Yeah, exactly. We used ChemDog for this particular uh, infusion. It's perfect ingredient for something that you want both aromatics it's a little bitter it's a little pungent it's got that yeah. kind of gassy it's kind of gassy piney yeah, yeah definitely exactly. an old school strain with those turtles right right so it works really well with our other roots um that one over there this one's for me that one's for you oh thank you All right. now, i'm curious like how infused is this is this going to get me super high or is it just going to get me a little high you know um i will say Tinctures always vary when you make them at home. Okay, because I like to get big high. <laughs> <laughs> but um, there are seven grams in here. So there's okay. a full, you know, quarter ounce. You know, the longer you let it sit, the more infused it gets. Um, so I would say probably what we have is probably somewhere 10 to 15 milligrams. Okay, so it's um, a nice light dose. Not super scientific, but, <laughs> uh, you know, I would say that's probably about what it is. Nice. Alright, so the final component is I'll just garnish with a lemon twist. I'll let you do that. You know, um, lemons actually have terpenes in them as well, mm -hmm. a little lemony. So it's, it goes well with that chem dog. Yep, exactly. Alright, so that's it. That's, that's our all. champagne cocktail. Hey, cheers Should we to cheers? That. Cheers. Cheers to Elion hey. and getting the most high. And we hope everyone has a happy new year. Hey, happy new year's and happy holidays, y'all. Cheers. Hey.